Right, hi Year 5s, this is just a very quick video, um, let's check my pen works, there we go, um, just going over prime numbers. Now we should have looked at prime numbers back in Year 4, maybe even Year 3 some of us. Um, so it's a really a retrieval of, of this knowledge, but what I want to show you is the quick, the easy way to find prime numbers systematically. Now remember, prime numbers are numbers that can only be divided by one in themselves, or invert that into times tables and multiplication, which you might find a bit easier, they can only be made by multiplying by one in themselves. So for example, if I give you an example like 7, you can only make 7 with 1 times 7. There is no other way of making 7 with the times tables. Okay, So it's a prime because it can only be multiplied by 1 and itself. Okay. And the way to find this is to do your little factor frisbees. So you find the facts of the number. So one times seven is seven. If we look, if we looked at number, I don't know, if we looked at number twelve and we did a factor frisbee, let's go systematic. We start with one. Can we do two? Two times six, yes. Then can we do three? Of course, we can. We can do three times four. Can we do four? Yes. And we've already used the four, so we're done. And that is how you find all the factors of a number. Okay, so doing a little factor frisbee. And it works with massive numbers as well. So, yeah, I say massive numbers. If you did 40, 1 times 40, go to 2, or 2 times 20, is it in the 3s? Uh, 33, 36, 39, no. Is it in the 4s? Well, yeah, 4 times 10. 5s? must be because it ends with a zero, so um, 8 times 5, 8 times 5 is 40, 6, 6, 6 is 36, no, 7, no, 8, right, we've got an 8, so we're done. So as soon as you come to a number you've done, you know you've finished them, as long as you go in order, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, like that, okay? So, let me get rid of these, and let's have a look for prime numbers. Now, the number 1 is special. Because remember, prime numbers can only be made by 1 times themselves. But 1 is itself. So there's an argument in maths as to whether pri uh, number 1 is prime. And people say it's not, because it's not 1 and itself. It is only 1. So it's not using 1 and another number. So mathematicians say that 1 is not prime. If we look at number 2, 1 times 2 is 2. Can we make any other? We can't make two in any other way. That fits the rule, doesn't it? One and itself. That's prime. Move on to three. One times three is three. Two times, no. One and itself. Three is prime. We've already looked at four, but I'll start it off. One times four is four. So we've done one, two. Ah, two times two. There we go. So that's not prime. 5. 1 times 5. 2. No. 3. No. No. 1. And itself. That's prime. 6. So this is the logical sequence to do it. 1 times 6 is 6. 2. 2 times 3. 3. Oh, we've done 3. That's done. Oops. So that's not prime. If you continue doing that all the way through, you will find all the numbers that are prime whilst finding all the factor pairs of these numbers. Okay, so frisbee, fa uh, factor frisbees. I think frisbee is double E. Is how you find factors nice and quickly and systematically. So go through one, two, three, no, five, six, seven, until you come to a number you've already got down. Then you know you're done. Okay, so a little bit of a trick here for your prime numbers. And remember, between 1 and 30. So today, can you find all the prime numbers between 1 and 30, even if you take a picture and your work looks like this? Okay, that would be, that'd be spot on. Okay, um, and for a lot of you, this will be retrieval. Okay, so shouldn't be too much of a problem today. As you get into the some of the num more obscure numbers, sort of, as you get to maybe you know, some of the higher ones, do be careful, because there might be something you miss, um, especially if you look at some of the challenges and you start looking at numbers like 52, 
you've, you've got to stop and think and still do the system one two is it in the threes go to multiplications you know so go times ten and things like that you know so I'll leave you alone I won't keep jabbering on but there is a little tip as to how to do your work today good luck